In this episode, we will introduce how to set up Uniview Dual Lens PTZ camera. We are going to introduce how to create the master slave linkage, how to add two cameras in one click, and how to make the best use of functions of back end devices. To create the master slave linkage, we need to calibrate cameras in advance. Click Panoramic Linkage under the Intelligent category. Go Linkage Parameter tab to make sure the panoramic linkage is enabled. Then hop to the Calibration option. It gives us two views, the panoramic shot and the close-up shot. Let's go with Auto Calibration first. To start with the setting, we need to find the little cross in the fixed lens camera and then navigate the PTZ to get its blue cross fixed in the same position of the fixed lens. Click Next to Forward, and then hit one-click Calibrate to initiate. Hold on for a minute. The system is now automatically calibrating. Click Finish to complete all settings. Manual calibration is also convenient. We can see six preset blue triangle signs of the panoramic view. And if it is the first time using manual calibration, we may find no triangle signs in the panoramic view. Don't worry, just switch back to auto calibration to calibrate. Then we will get the triangle signs. Get the requested coordinates below and hit Modify. Click Locate Sign and then roll with the PTZ to navigate its blue cross to the same area we've made in the fixed lens. And then click Orient to confirm. Now we can see a new longitude and latitude for where our PTZ is located. This helps PTZ realize where it should be aiming when certain events happen. Repeat the linkage action for the rest 5 points. Now the linkage is going to be locked. In most cases, auto calibration and manual calibration are complementary. Auto calibration helps find the rough linkage coordinates, and the manual calibration enhances accuracy by the further manual adjustment. Currently, the PTZ in fixed lens should be finely communicating. And what we are doing next is coming back to the setup and hopping to the smart settings under Intelligent. Let's set the cross line as an example. Draw the line at any position on the screen, then adjust its sensitivity. The higher the sensitivity, the easier the alarm is going to be triggered. Here we are choosing motor vehicle, non-motor vehicle and pedestrian as the detection object. Go trigger action to make sure the panoramic linkage is enabled. We can also enable alarm light and alarm sound to achieve a better warning performance. Let's now go back to the live view and watch the linkage work. The PTZ is trying hard to catch pedestrian that crosses the line. Uniview Dual Lens PTZ camera can accurately track the intrusion target while still monitoring the original direction live view. With two lenses acting together seamlessly, the camera looks out for every single corner, from intersections, park perimeters to city centers. Uniview Dual Lens PTZ camera features easy operations of the back-end device as well. We can have two channels added at a time with only one click. Click Add All. Hold on a second. 
The channels of Fixed Lens and PTZ are both online now. We are therefore able to fulfill some pretty useful linkage tracking functions on the Live View page. Directly hit the binocular camera icon on the bottom side toolbar. We can find some pretty useful functions here. Frame zoom in, with this function, we can draw a frame anywhere on the main page, and the slave will automatically rotate. Manual tracking function, with this function, when the slave is tracking an intrusion target, we can also manually change the tracking target at any time. Click linkage function, with this function, we can click anywhere on the main page, and the slave will automatically locate it. Let's have a look at the frame zoom in function. Draw a frame anywhere on the main page, and the slave will automatically rotate and follow.